Hey guys, Buck Creek here, and tonight we have the Browning 25 ACP again. The BB Browning, I want to say. Uh, we're going to take it apart, assemble, assemble, and we are going to clean it. This is a 22 bore stroke, but hopefully it works for a 25 as well. Who knows? So we're going to go ahead and get started with the process. First thing we're going to do, make sure it's unloaded. Simply take the magazine out. When I say simply, it's a pain, as you saw in the last video. Nothing in the magazine, as you can see, no bullets. You have to put the weapon on fire. Nothing in the chamber. We are clear. We're gonna push the slide a little bit forward. Put your gun on safety position, like so. Take your barrel, pop it up a little bit so it's right there. Then you're gonna hold it, take it off, safe, put it on fire. And that's going to make it slide forward. My phone again. Just watch that uh, spring, make sure it doesn't slide out too much. And now you have your main components of the firearm. So now you're going to check the barrel, make sure everything's clear there. And I'm not going to bother taking the barrel too much yet. I'm just going to clean the inside of right here in the chamber of this. I don't know exactly how to take the barrel out actually if I'm honest, but we'll get a good enough clean. This hasn't been shot much at all. So, take a little napkin, napkin. I think we're going to put a little bit of this on here. We're not going to use CLP. We're going to use a little bit of gun oil. Freshness in a bottle. I had to zoom up a little bit because the gun is so small. Just gonna rub in there. Just front of this. Get all that junk off. the bottom of this out a little bit. A lot of the stuff that was on it <laughs> looks like nicotine, honestly. Cleaning that off really nicely. And then we're going to clean the inside of here. It's going to be slippery after this. It's going to be a pain to get back together. Oh, my phone going off once again. Checking the chamber here. That spring is in fine shape. This oh, spring fell out, but it's okay. It is right there. Watch the guide rods. This has been shot very, very minimal. I think it is time to put it back together. We got everything nice and cleaned up. So in order to put it back together, uh, it's gonna be tricky. So my hands are just soaking oil. First you need to take your ramrod, if it fell out, put it back in. As you can see, take your, do it this way. Take your very, very slippery, uh, Upper receiver, I'm gonna call it. And then slide it back on. Slide this back here. Until it clicks into place. 
Take your barrel and rotate it till it's down towards that way. Hold your slide. And let it slide forward. Take your magazine. Pop it in. And we're going to see if it fires. Oh, where is my camera? There we go. Yep, it fired. That's all nice and cleaned up. And it's ready to be used again. That wasn't as dirty as other guns I've done before. It's about all the dirt that came out of it. Although I didn't get into the integrals. 25 ACP Browning. <laughs> Hard to cock. Nice little gun. It's now officially cleaned and ready for action. Well guys, I hope you like this. Please make sure to like, subscribe for more. It's been Buck Creek.